L4. So this is the evening of day one. So this is your last one before you go home. Is it Joe Pasquale? It is Joe Pasquale. <laughs> no. Oh, I was hoping you'd do the voice. Elbow deep in mucus. <laughs> Uh, so Armitage is little good to say about odious little man that is Pasquale Fenton, Arkham's most celebrated occultist. He and Armitage have had a lifelong rivalry, too much the showman and, some might argue, charlatan for most tastes. However, Pasquale manages to make an impressive living. His mansion is tawdry and garish, decorated with a vast collection of the occult, including deformities in jars, unusual medical devices and jewellery that evokes satanic ritual. He invites you in cordial, cordially enough, but the smirk that appears in his arrogant face when he learns the reason behind your call raises his hackles. Oh, so now I'm consulted on this matter. I would have thought that bumbling idiot Garrison would have come himself rather than sending his protégés. Biting your tongue, you explain the wound on the young lady and why the police would be concerned. Pasquale realises he's being a bit nasty and changes his tone. Trees. She went on about being attacked by trees, did she? I would suggest that you have stumbled upon cultists of Shub Nigrath, also known as the Black Goat with a Thousand Young. There are mutterings of certain dark rituals that, well, her followers use a sacrificial victim to host the spawn from unholy seed to infant. The wound on this woman may be that, or maybe she's just insane. The mad abound in Arkham, as I know you've heard from the stories. That would be a better guess. Pasquale pauses and you encourage him to tell you more about Shub Nigrath. He is a bit reluctant to share his knowledge, but continues. A spawn of Shub Nigrath is sliced free from the flesh of the host and brought into this world to wreak whatever horrors it may. Investigate the witch cults in Arkham if you truly want to go down this path. It very well may, it very well may be that the lady who is attacked is delusional from some poison, or she made it up altogether. You ask what the spawn is likely to do, if indeed it has been born into the world, and Pasquale bites his lower lip. For now, nothing. The spawn will take a number of years to fully mature. The texts speak of these creatures often attacking domesticated animals, particularly dogs and cats. Even in seed form, the animals can sense their evil presence. With this, you thank Pasquale for his insights and leave. Whoa, dude. Monsters. Missing cat. Holy shit. The missing cat. <laughs> I knew it was relevant. Um... Okay, so that fits in with, you know, obviously, assume it's already been cut out of her, since that's what they were saying. Someone trying to. Uh, Someone extracted the young of yeah. Shubnigrath already. Is Edward her name for her baby? Her baby. <laughs> Is Edward the spawn of Shubnigrath? <laughs> Edward, stop. No, it hurts. Edward, don't you love me? to follow so long time <laughs> apparently there's an Edward M in here that's going to be the surname though yeah. yes that's M, M Edward M. Monster Edward I was actually looking in here for Emperor Home I'm, I, I've not been able to find it I wanted to know if we because they said it was opposite the hospital right yeah but um I just want to know if we take a punt at that because it's it's been mentioned twice. Owners of the Emperor home. The owners of the Emperor home. You should just Tricky to know. Yeah. Uh, well, that's end of day one. Uh, so mm -hmm. you've done your, your three bits of investigating there. Uh, technically nothing happens in between the days. There's no... Mm. There's no paperwork to, <laughs> to be filed at this point. We have an app. Uh, yeah, have a nap, get ready to go to the bakery in the morning. Thinking's <laughs> hard. <laughs> Wake me up when we get to the bakery. But you're three clues down, you've got 11 clues left. Doesn't feel like much, right? <laughs> Feels like loads. <laughs> feel like we've already basically solved it. It was obviously cultists of Shub Yeah, <laughs> I mean... Uh, operating out of the, uh, the Emperor home. Let's go there. How do we get there? So what was the last bit when they were talking about missing dogs and cats? So what uh, the young, the spawn of the young does. Yeah. Uh, so the spawn will take a number of years to fully mature. The mm -hmm. texts speak of these creatures often attacking domesticated animals, particularly dogs and cats. 
Even in seed form, the animals can sense their evil presence. Mm-hmm. Even in seed form. So that's so that would be they'd be able to detect it, uh, even like while she was still carrying it. I assume. And so the guy missing his cat was D. Pickman. D. Pickman on Parsonage Street. Um. Yep. Looking it up right now. Where is he? Pers- <laughs> As long as we don't uh, go there when he says, yeah, my cat's gone, what? <laughs> the L19. <laughs> Have you got any information about my cat? What? <laughs> Come on, don't just say, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. Well, I now that the, the uh, but now that the, the, the well, uh, we're L19, where is that? It'll be... Down here somewhere, uh, 16, 19's over here. So, so close to the park, yeah, close-ish kind of a... to the church. I mean, it's all this part of town. Yeah. Um, so I don't know if that tells us more or less. Um, but I'd be interested to know if the cat came back. The very next day. <laughs> yeah. Thought it was a gunner. Um, although that wouldn't tell us anything useful. So, so what's the... Can you pass the newspaper, please? One the... paper... Yeah, so this isn't the paper that a cat went missing so on Parsons Street or whatever. CS, missing tabby cat, SI reward to D. Pickman, Pickman uh, S. Parsonage Street. Um, I assume SI is seeking information? Or CS? CS is customer <laughs> service? <laughs> Uh, <laughs> computer science. Uh, cat stolen. I, uh, cat st- <laughs> help if you if we knew more about these um, abbreviations. Maybe hey, that's the point. So what did we say? L fourteen. L nineteen. You said L nineteen. There. Now that it's day two, do you think the crime scene will be more or less vacant? I'm not entirely sure what more we'd learn from the. I'm seen. Well, because if, if it was so, there was the guy lingering with his birthmark thing. So maybe we guess that's Edward. It's like I'm. That's it. Yeah. Could be the cat. It could be the Edward. Could be the cat. Um, cat people. <laughs> cat people. Yeah. So yeah, L nineteen is where D Pickman lives. Um, so that's, that's a, cause I'm feeling like I'm one, so the, the thing about the cat and also the haunted home is that they're kind of peripheral and I'm wondering if, if we take a punt at them, whether we'll be rewarded or punished. <laughs> um, well, so I'm, I'm interested by this whole in seed form, although, you know, if, if you know. Did the cat see something? Can we get the cat on the witness stand? Uh, <laughs> can, you need to find the cat first. It's missing. Uh, do we have a psychic yeah. contact that can communicate with the cat? Uh, uh, no, I do not. Do we it. have a, a cat who can like? Um. Um. We've got a trauma surgeon. That's no good. Uh, the librarian. Has restricted section access. Maybe she can get us a <laughs> talk to cat's book. Yeah, because the uh, um, <laughs> I, I mean, I mean, my gut says talk to the cat man. Bada bada bee, bada bada boo. <laughs> exactly, but maybe I'm just biased because you know cats. I'm, I'm uh, more interested uh, in rescuing uh, this cat <laughs> than solving this nonsense with a woman and such. So yeah, she sounds uh, like she your brought it. Your lead investigator for this one. Oh, that's true, actually. Yeah. Um, so, look, it's her own fault for going and shagging Chef Nigrath. <laughs> yeah, getting herself Edward. impregnated. Yes, with um, the seed child of the old god. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, let's go talk to a man about a cat. L19? We need to put an end to this dastardly occultist plan <laughs> to, to devour cats. domesticated exactly. animals. Save the kitty cat. L19. A sharp-dressed woman in a hat with a baby cradle on her hip answers the door. Is it a seed baby? <laughs> <laughs> Looks like a normal baby. 
You ask about her cat, and she describes the animal to you. It's unlikely that this is relevant to your investigation, oh. but you offered to call upon her if you'd come across the feline. That's it. God <laughs> damn it! I knew it was relevant! <laughs> I'm making notes. Baby. Woman. <laughs> uh, Armitage didn't find out about that shit. Right. Um, Might come up in the questions at the end. Yeah. What was the woman cradling when you questioned her when she talked about her cat? A baby seed. I eat babies. If only we could find out who owns the Emperor home from this goddamn directory, then we could go there. It's in there. That's not, is it? Yeah. Da da dun da ba ba da 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 The unnameable house. Private residential. Uh, residential student uh, private private companies. Other locations? No. The unvisited aisle. Hmm. What do you remember to Sunderbury? Nah, I'd have to look, but It's definitely a place. Oh, uh, did you try E? I did, I tried E already. Yeah, but you're not very good at looking things up. I'm pretty sure I checked E. We checked E. Leave me alone. Don't be mean to me. Uh, witch house. <laughs> witch, witch house. house. <laughs> um, that's the where the witches are. <laughs> Which house? <laughs> the witch there's, house. There's, a, yeah, and there's the no Amazon. emperor. Oh, no, so there is emperor W. <laughs> yeah, Mike looked it up. Don't worry. Well, yeah, but I was looking for like emperor house. I didn't consider emperor was a it's surname. Is, yeah. I thought it was like the sort of the name of the building. Um, U forty one. That's not really opposite the hospital, though, is it? Uh, where's forty one? U forty one. Five, six. It is pretty long. Thirty-nine, sixty, fifties, forty-four. Oh, there. U forty-one's there. No hospital was here. Where was the hospital? I thought the hospital was the hospital here at C eleven. Is oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, C eleven? Yeah. Sort of. Um. Okay. Good. Well, do you want to go there? Well, I, I mean, after that thrilling Did success the there, I'm the going to just completely defer this after one. After the cat debacle. <laughs> right. I'm feeling good about this one. So, okay, so U4 you, do you want? U41. Look, if, we're, if you're going to waste a day, might as well waste a Tuesday. <laughs> yes. 